really need to follow Bree's advice? Hey guys, it's Alyssa. Welcome to my NaNoWriMo vlog number 16, I believe. And it is the 13th day of November, aka day 13 of NaNoWriMo. The necessary word count for today is 21,671 words. My current word count is 32,492 words. That is roughly 8,000 words away from hitting 40,000 words, and from there on, it is a uphill-ish, downhill slope to the finish line. <laughs> so today's video is going to be kind of short, and um, I am just... Oh, so today's video is about dealing with stress, because currently I am a mess. I am emotionally, physically, and mentally exhausted. I had a little cry party in the car on the drive home today, because today just sucked so bad. And then I got behind all the bad drivers, including buses. So today's video is about dealing with stress. Now there is really only one true answer to this question. How do you deal with stress? It's an overarching answer. So obviously this has subcategories and there are many other things you could probably also do. But I have one thing in particular that if someone came to me and asked me how they should deal with being stressed or dealing with any of the emotional, mental, physical exhaustions that I'm currently going through, I would just say relax. And if you are anything like me, it is really, really hard to stop doing something that you know you have to do. For instance, if I'm doing homework, I will do homework for five hours straight without a single break simply because I feel like I have to get it done. Once I start it, I must start it and finish it in one sitting. And that applies to all of my homework for one night and individual homework assignments. That is a bad thing. That is such a bad thing because more often than not when I do that, I get so stressed out because I've been working my butt off for the last five hours and I usually haven't finished my homework at that point, but even though it crossed my mind and it was a desire of mine to take a break in the past five hours, I didn't do it. I wouldn't do it. Now, partially this is because I know that I would start procrastinating and I do not want to procrastinate on homework especially, but 10 minutes, 10 minutes is all you need. Take breaks relax, especially when you have the time to. And that's really all I can say. Just what I do is I relax, I watch brainless YouTube videos, and I eat food. And I am happy, and it helps me de-stress myself. And I don't know what works for every individual person. Obviously, that is my recommendation. Just relax, watch YouTube videos, eat food, junk food if you want, if it makes you feel better. Don't think too much, or at all, preferably. You just need people, not, people just need to learn to slow down, back up a couple feet, and allow themselves to relax. I am being kind of hypocritical right now because I don't do this, but I'm definitely gonna start trying because I just, I cannot continue to treat myself this way and make it not only through the rest of NaNoWriMo, but through the rest of life. Because I will be working until the day I die, probably. Even when I'm retired, I will likely find something to be doing. But you just need to stop, relax. Lay down in the bed if you want to, that's what I do. My computer's over here on the desk, you can't see it. But my computer's over there and my desk is over there and I usually sit on my desk chair, but when I get too stressed and I really just want to forget about it and relax, I get on the bed, I prop my computer up with a pillow and watch YouTube videos for hours if I have the time to. And I am actually gonna go do that right now because like I said, I had a little cry party in the car on the way home because everyone has their breaking points and I kind of reached mine. 
I fully plan on writing 1,667 1, words today, and I hope you guys get your 1,667 words finished. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another NaNoWriMo vlog, but until then, happy writing.